Welcome back, YouTube. Today we're doing a rapper tier list. Everyone knows I have all of the correct hip hop opinions, so I'll be doing most of the talking. I don't have hip hop opinions. I only have hip hop facts. What you have is dementia, Sleepy Joe. I could put you to sleep with one right hook, Trumpy Rumpy. Joe, if you punched someone, your fist would probably disintegrate. You want to find out Obama, you little rat? Let's just get the tier list started with Drake. Drake is a very high tier rapper. Just look at the crazy numbers he does. Just because he's popular doesn't mean he's good. Joe won the popular vote, and he's basically dead. What the hell, Obama? We're supposed to be on the same team here. Hey, at least you didn't lose the popular vote both times like this orange bitch. You are making things political to distract from Drizzy's greatness. I knew you would do this. Of course it's political. I'm the fucking president. And we used to be President Trump. No, do not put me in the same category as your nerdy ass Obama. Absolutely not. You know, I did enjoy Drake on the show Degrassi. Yes, we all know Degrassi is a great show. I have seen every episode, but we're talking about rap here. Drake is going in tier A. What about another cash money rapper, Lil Wayne? Believe it or not, Lil Wayne is actually very tall in real life. He is six foot five, which is almost as tall as I am. You're not six five, Trump. Trump is more like six feet wide from all the fucking McDonald's he eats. Do not bring McDonald's into this, old man. I have just Googled how tall you are, Trump, and it says you are six three, you lying asshole. That is total fake news. And it says Joe is only six feet tall. Joe, you are basically a manlet. What the hell is a manlet Obama-rama? Joe, I'm surprised you can even see over the podium when you do speeches. I think everyone is surprised when he is awake enough to do a speech. Fuck both both of you guys. I'm taller than both of you when I stand on the White House, which is where I live in case you bitches forgot. You always pull that card. Don't make me pull the two-term card. Everyone knows I'm going to get a second term, too, because my opponent is an orange obese Oompa Loompa. If you call me orange one more time, I'm going to beat the living shit out of you. I'm going to say it. Don't you do it. You're orange. I'm going to kill you, old man. Mark my words. I'm just going to put Lil Wayne into the B tier. Now let's move on to Travis Scott. Wait, before we move on to Travis Scott Obama, what would your rapper name be if you were a rapper? The B man, of course. The fucking B man? That's literally the worst rapper name I've ever heard, Barack. You should be ashamed of yourself. I'm not gonna lie, Obama Rama, that's pretty bad. Well, I think it's a cool rapper name, and I bet the comments agree with me. They definitely don't agree with you, Obama. What does the B even stand for? Does it stand for bomb like all the countries you bombed while you were president? No, you idiot. We don't have time for this. Comment below what Trump's and Biden's rapper names would be. Now let's move on to Travis Scott on the tier list. Travis Scott is easily one of the best rappers of all time. You're probably just saying that because he collabed with McDonald's, you fat fuck. That's just one of many reasons why he is goaded. Also, I have my own McDonald's collab coming out soon. Very soon. That's the stupidest shit I've ever heard. Who the hell would buy that? Everyone will be buying it. It's going to be called the Mar-a-Lago meal, and it's dropping next week. What is it? It's just two Big Macs stacked on top of each other. That's even dumber than I thought. And people say I'm the senile one. My point is this. Travis Scott clearly belongs in the tier A. I'm actually fine with that. Also, yes, people do say that you're senile Biden. Many, many people say this. Oh yeah? Name one person. Your wife. She told me last night. Okay, we get it. Now, where's Nicki Minaj going? Nicki Minaj has a very large ass. Perhaps even one of the largest. Her boobs are also of a very immense size. This is true. I've seen them. Okay, but what about the music? Music? Who gives a shit about the music? I didn't know she was a rapper. You barely know that you're the president. I'm the what now? Obama, I wouldn't really expect you to know this, but having a huge ass is an important part of hip hop. Yes, even for the men. What? You heard what I said, old man? I can't support this. Only people with an IQ as low as yours could listen to her. Nicki Minaj is going into the C tier. Now, what about a real rapper like Jay-Z? A real rapper? More like an ancient rapper. He's almost as old as Joe. Jay-Z is much younger than you are, dumbass. He's so old, his first album dropped on a phonograph. Hey, don't hate on phonographs. Those were fine machines. He is basically the Biden of the rap game. So he always wins? Is that what you mean? No, Biden does not win. Check the scoreboard, bitch. I'll check it in 2024 from the Oval Office. You'll never set foot in here again, fat ass. Oh my God, you are making things political again? We have to move on. Jay-Z can go in B tier. Whatever. Let's move on to Kendrick Lamar. Kendrick Lamar is a total nerd, just like you, Obama. You've probably never even listened to a full Kendrick Lamar album. You have the attention span of a goldfish. That's true. I'm surprised Trump can even stay focused for these videos. I'm playing Plants vs. Zombies right now. That's how I stay awake for both of your boring ass takes. You play that kitty game? It sucks ass. I'm surprised you would say that, Joe, since you are basically a plant and a zombie. What Kendrick Lamar songs have you even heard, Trump? I did enjoy Humble. I will say that. You're the least humble person in existence. That's wrong. I'm extremely humble. Maybe one of the most humble presidents ever.
ever. Everyone has heard Humble. I also oh, like Sicko Mode. He had a good feature on that. I should have guessed you wouldn't be able to appreciate Kendrick. I enjoy Logan Paul's songs. That is what I have to say to that. Of course you do. He's another rapper for people with shockingly low IQs. Well, Kendrick is going into the S tier where he obviously belongs. Now, what about Wiz Khalifa? This is just one of those guys who raps about weed all the time. What's wrong with rapping about weed? I mean, it can get a little old. Maybe do a couple of squares like you, it does. There's nothing wrong with rapping about weed or smoking weed all day, every day. But Joe, you're the president. That's debatable. That's right, I am. Nobody can stop me. Now, Wiz has his own brand of weed called Khalifa Kush. Unfortunately, it is very weak. It might as well be a tossed salad compared to the truly nefarious dark sticks I'm lighting on the daily. And for that reason, he will go into B tier. I don't totally understand what you just said, but let's just move on to Cardi B. Here's an interesting hip hop fact for all the viewers at home. Cardi B has very large breasts. So do you, Joe. I see your big man titties. I have man titties? No, your fat ass has massive man milkers. I really don't want to picture this. Well, you have to, bitch. I enjoy the song WAP. Yeah, I'm sure you do, but I'm just going to go ahead and put her in the C tier. Now it is time to talk about the GOAT rapper Eminem. You know, his real name actually isn't Eminem. It's actually Marshall Mathers. Everybody fucking knows that, dumbass. Oh, okay. Shut up, both of you. Eminem is definitely S tier. No discussion needed here. Doesn't Eminem pretty much hate you, Donald? Doesn't everyone pretty much hate you, Barry? I was actually way more popular than both of you losers. Anyway, he's S tier. Moving on. Logic is next. Logic is another very good white rapper. You don't see too many of those these days. Of course, originally all of the rappers were white. This was because of racist segregation laws. But after Martin Luther King Jr. marched on Washington, they opened hip hop up to everyone. I swear, every day Joe loses about 20 brain cells. Okay, first of all, logic is half black. That can't be true. Obama, you're half black. Yes, and what's your point? Is he allowed to say that word? All his songs are about being half black, dumbass. Are your hearing aids broken? My hearing aids are working fine. Do you want your legs broken? Well, anyway, logic isn't that great, so he'll go in C tier. Now, what about 6 9 6 9 will go straight into D tier. Snitching goes against the streets. What do you know about the streets? You're the biggest punk ass bitch I know. Settle down there, Pablo Escobar. I have driven on many different streets in this fine country. If you're not strapped up like a pair of lederhosen and sipping purple on the daily, then you don't know shit about the streets, bitch. Your candy ass is probably gonna snitch in all 10 of the trials you have coming up too. I will actually be snitching on Pence very soon. That being said, 6 9 or Daniel Hernandez, as I like to call him, is terrible and goes in D tier. For once, I agree. Next is Snoop Dogg. I thought his name was Snoop Lion now. He changed it back, dumbass. Please try to keep up. Maybe you should change your name back to Drump. Maybe you should change back to being a kid sniffer instead of the president. Maybe you should change back to being a game show host. Maybe you should change your son back to life. Whoa, whoa. Let's just put Snoop Dogg in tier A and move on. To Polo G. Polo G has put out a lot of bangers, but because he's with the Vice Lords and I'm with the Gangster Disciples, I have to say fuck him and put him in D tier. Joe, how many times do I have to tell you that you're not in the Gangster Disciples? We're moving on to 50 Cent now. 50 Cent? I've never heard of him. He must be a very poor rapper. If I was a rapper, I would call myself 50 billion. You don't have 50 billion. I will once my McDonald's collab drops. Yeah, you'll have 50 billion calories for your fat ass. How about 50 billion drone strikes on you and all my ops when I'm back in office? He should be in fucking S tier, but you two are being ridiculous. Put him in C tier because he's poor. He's not fucking poor. 50 cent is a billionaire. Trump is usually wrong, but I'm happy with C tier. Jesus Christ, how are you putting him in C tier? Comment below if you think 50 cent should be higher than C tier. Now what about ASAP Rock? His name is too complicated. How do you pronounce it? A dollar sign app? What is that? I'm putting him in C tier. Oh my God, Biden is now so old he can't even read. I can read real words, not dumbass Zoomer rap names. Maybe Obama can help you. We all know he was a master at reading teleprompters. I'm not going to bother trying to explain this to your ancient ass, Joe. Let's just move on to 21 Savage. Savage is British. Nothing more needs to be said. When I'm president, I will deport him back to that island once again. D tier. Okay, the last one is Kanye. Kanye is apparently going to be running for president in 2024. Only I should be allowed to do that, so he belongs in D tier. I don't care who runs, since I'm just going to win again anyway. You and that jackass can do whatever you want. If I dropped out, even Kanye could beat you. Nobody likes you, Joe. Your mom liked me last night. My mom is dead. Ha ha, your mom is dead. Your mom is dead too, you idiot. Oh yeah, fuck. But what about Kanye's music? Music? This guy is literally the Hitler of the rap game. But what about graduation? Oh yeah, okay, he can go in S tier then. Fuck you, Kanye. Stay in your lane, music boy. 